This is insane. I've just tricked Epic into giving me all of these skins. I literally got the Renegade Raider, the Ghoul Trooper, the Skull Trooper. This is overpowered. This is probably the best glitch I've ever seen in my life. You guys need to go ahead and do this right now. Here's the tutorial for you. I have found the best new free skins glitch here inside of Fortnite, which literally lets you get any skin in the game that you want, such as the Renegade Raider, the Pink Ghoul Trooper, the Purple Skull Trooper, whatever it may be. What you guys are going to want to do is go to your locker and you guys are going to want to select everything as default. This is officially starting the glitch, so let's go. So we'll officially select everything as default. You're going to want to make sure that you have nothing equipped. You want to have the default pickaxe, the default glider, default everything. So we'll go ahead. You can have an umbrella. It's okay if you have an umbrella as long as it is the plain default umbrella. So let's go ahead and select everything default. You cannot have a contrail and then it's okay if you have um, emotes, but you can't have any wraps. So you're going to want to go ahead and select everything as default right here. And the reason why you do this is because it basically tricks Epic into thinking you are a fully default. Basically, you're that you're a test account, which they can give the skins to. So let's go ahead and select everything default right here. This is actually so insane. Let's go ahead and pick everything default. Okay, there we go. So now we are a default in the lobby. And next up, you guys are going to want to click on normal battle royale and make sure that you are on duos mode. So you need to be on duos mode. And I don't know why this is. It doesn't matter if you're on fill or no fill, but you do need to be on duos mode. And next up, guys, you're going to want to go to your settings, go to the final one right here that looks like a person. And you guys are going to want to make sure that you have can receive gifts on. So if you don't have can receive gifts on, it's not going to work. Make sure you turn can receive gifts on. Next up, guys, put your hidden matchmaking delay on one. And then you guys are going to want to queue into the game. So I have my hidden matchmaking delay on one. And now I'm officially queuing in to the game. And once you guys start queuing to the game, you turn hidden matchmaking delay off. So there we go. Now we are going to queue into the game and I'll see you guys in the battle bus. All right, now I'm officially in the battle bus and we can get started on the next step of this thing. So you guys are going to want to go ahead and land somewhere far away where other players are not going to go. I'd recommend one of these side islands right here. There's not a certain one it has to be, but I'd recommend landing on one of these side little rocks because it's basically going to tell Epic these are special employee spots that basically empo employees will land at when they're actually going ahead and doing this glitch. You're going to want to land at one of these far away special employee spots, preferably one of these three rocks. If you want to go to the same one as me, you can go right there, but it doesn't matter as long as you go to one of the employee spots right here. My game is kind of glitching a little bit, so let's go ahead and go down. I'm going to the one to the left of Pleasant Piazza, but as long as you land on one of these rocks over here, you should be okay. So any of these far away rocks, you just have to make sure that you're not going to die to another player. So I'm going to go ahead and land on top of this rock and we can get started on the next step once I'm there. But this is very important. Important. Everything now is crucial because you guys are almost finished the free skins glitch. So you're going to want to make sure you land over here and do everything properly now. So let's go ahead and we're going to land on this rock. And once you guys land on this rock, you are going to want to go into your settings. So now that I've officially landed on the rock, I'm going to want to go to my settings and you're going to want to click on reporting, not your settings. Go to reporting and then hit report a bug or player. And as you guys can see, now hit report a player and go down to the bottom and hit on cheating and hacking because this is it's not hacking the game, obviously, to get the free skins, but it is uh, kind of cheating or something to get all the skins so you want to click on cheating and hacking and next up You'll see a list of players. You're gonna want to scroll down right to the bottom and as you guys can see for me It's jumpy mcjump 64, but for you it could be something else It obviously will be and now this is the most crucial part right here where you guys have to report a player and type in the code. You guys are going to want to type in this exact code. This is an Epic Games employee code slash pin number. So this is how the glitch will work. So we're going to type in 2094-7811-2363. So you guys have to copy this exact code right here. And you guys got to make sure you have the dashes. So there's the code 2094 dash seven eight one one dash two three six three right there and you're gonna want to hit continue and next up it says you're about to report jumpy mcjump 64 for cheating and hacking and hit accept so we'll go ahead and do that and now you are gonna want to close it 
And next up, guys, you're going to want to jump off the rock that you landed on safely, go into the water, and you're going to want to go over to some land. But you still have to make sure that you will not die to another player. So be very, very careful on this part right here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to farm up some materials. You're going to probably need around 200 materials if you want to be safe. So I'm going to go ahead and get around 200 materials to do the final step of the glitch. And also make sure that you guys have no weapons. It's not going to work if you have weapons. So make sure you have no weapons. And once you guys get around 200 materials, 250 materials, you're going to want to build up and it, you can't get shot down by another player. So make sure that you guys are far away enough from other players that you will be okay. And as you guys can see, I am right now. I'm far away enough that I'm not going to get shot down by other players. So the glitch will work. And next up, guys, now that I'm probably easily high enough that I'm going to die, what you're going to want to do is go back into the reporting screen that you were on. Hit on report a bug or player again, and you're just going to want to do the same thing, cheating and hacking, and scroll down to the bottom and click on Jumpy McJump again. Next up, guys, you're just going to want to do continue, and it's going to say you're about to report them in again, and you don't have to put in the code again, and I'm just going to, you hit no. I don't want to block this person, and then you accept it. I sent in the report, and then there we go. I am on top of this again now, and what you're going to want to do next is you cannot go ahead and jump off. If you jump off, it's actually not going to work because Epic Games knows that you are a fake account if you jump off. So you have to fake and die accidentally. And the way you can do that is actually editing yourself off. So what you're going to want to do is stand on a part where you can edit yourself off, just like I'm doing right here. So I'll just go ahead, and then you're just going to want to actually go ahead and edit yourself off so you die to a fall this way. So as you guys can see, I built up high enough where I'm going to die to a fall. And now I'm just going to want to edit off right about here and I should be good to go ahead and die now and you can move around and then as you guys can see there we go I've officially died and edited it off next up guys you're gonna want to go ahead and return to lobby because you've officially completed the glitch and now I'll explain how you can actually go ahead and claim your skins because that's probably the most important part of the whole video obviously you want to get your skin so let's go ahead and return to lobby right here and there you guys can go. So as you guys can see now, we do have my locker. So my locker is going to have skins that I have before. But guys, if you get lucky, you will get a pop-up on screen like the start of the video with a bunch of skins. But if you don't get that pop-up, no worries. Basically, guys, over the next few hours, you are going to see pop-ups of skins just appearing in your locker. It might not necessarily pop up right on your screen. But skins will start showing up in your locker, new skins will be there, and you guys will be able to equip them and use them in-game. So it's honestly so insane, because you basically just tricked Epic Games into thinking that you were actually an Epic Games employee because you did that glitch and entered the pin. But obviously you're not, but you will still get the benefits of getting all of the skins for free so it's honestly so amazing so yeah that's all for this fortnite glitch i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope it's gonna help you